Rapid just abruptly pulled off the road. I'll just drive it, it might upset you. Bye, halfway crack house. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. As some of you may already know, we are making the transition from boat life to road life. We will eventually travel North America in an RV, but we are currently off our sailboat Naughty Nature and have been spending some time in Huntington Beach while Naughty has been up for sale in Grenada for the past few months. We haven't gotten any new words on any offers for Naughty. So we figured we'd come down here and just enjoy the day. We're hitting the road for Texas to visit Brian's brother. Living in limbo here in Huntington Beach has been great but we're itching to start our new life on the road. And honestly, we need a change of scenery. So we decided to take matters into our own hands with the sweet mid-size rental car that was way fancier than we expected. We packed all our belongings to start our new adventure. It's not RV life yet, but it's a start. All packed. How do you feel about how everything okay. fit? Uh, I knew it was gonna be tight and it's dead on, man. That's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. We've done this a couple times. So. A couple times. <laughs> uh, squeezing shoes in little corners and mm -hmm. you know, leaving ourselves room for food. You ready for Texas? Yeah. My body's not, but I am. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get going. All right, cars packed, coffees in hand, and we're off. Our first destination is Albuquerque, New Mexico, where we plan to stay for the night. We've got a few cool spots to check out along the way, so stick around for the adventure. Brian just abruptly pulled off the road. Why did we abruptly pull off the road? Well, as we were cruising along. It's true. They got, they got no arms and no full hands. I told Brian that if there was anything weird he wanted to stop for last second, that I'm always down for that and I'm not in a hurry. Two minutes later, Brian just peels off and slams on the brakes so that we could come here. <laughs> The, the screen is an inch by an inch, and I saw a deer and people like. I an inch know. is big, okay. <laughs> I thought they were real. <laughs> <laughs> they were more plastic. Oh, I was mistaken. We, we need to apparently realize that when we see something off in the distance, we don't just get to walk over to the side of the boat to go look at it. Somebody still has to steer. <laughs> Sheriff's Department. Santa Barbara. County of Santa Barbara Sheriff's Department. That's the first time I did that. I just drove over a driving train. Moving train? Steaming train? Moving. What do engineers do? <laughs> <laughs> Albuquerque. 
Albuquerque. No reservations. We're winging it. We're gonna see who has room for us. Are my eyes as bloodshot as they feel? Yeah, I feel really dry. Bloodshot too. Yes. We grabbed a hotel and we got some pizza. And I just realized something that's gonna make Brian a little upset, maybe. Not in a, a serious way, just a joking way. Brian spells his name with an I and just makes fun of people that spell their name with a Y for no reason, but just to be silly. They gave us our salad and it has Brian spelled with a Y. <laughs> I have an important question for you. I love important questions. Don't drive yet, it might upset you. Four. It was such a good sleep. Are you ready to go? No. <laughs> well, we just checked out. They let us back in relatively quick, less than an hour from the alarm going off. And uh, we got a nice shower in. We got pizza leftovers for breakfast and the car ride. Goodbye, halfway crack house. It was very weird. This is the weirdest, one of the weirdest places. And I've stayed in hostels too, and I feel like this was nastier than hostels I've been in. Yeah, we woke up this morning and hopped in the shower. When I put my feet in the tub, it was just a trail of mud or dirt that just washed off the bottom of my feet. It was, it was pretty gross, so. It was just very, yeah. It was dirty. Very dirty and broken and just, I mean, oh, I think it's like most businesses are just not what they picture, what they present online <laughs> at all, <laughs> whatsoever. <laughs> so. Uh... Oh, my God. But it was really cheap. It was 60 bucks. It was 60 bucks. It was 60 bucks. So we got 60 bucks worth of sleeping. Coffee. Why is there no coffee? And, uh, yeah. So they, uh, had no coffee in their pot. And as I walked over the counter, she's like, oh, is that it? And I was like, you know, there's no coffee. And she's like, okay, just gas then. I was like, no, there's no coffee. She was, she says, oh. Oh yeah, uh, I tried to start in this morning. They didn't work. Okay, I can go get coffee somewhere else, no problem. And then I went to go pay for gas with a hundred. And she's like, I can't break a hundred. <laughs> so I just kind of chuckled and left. I'll get coffee and gas somewhere else. So we'll go from there. <laughs> Welcome to Albuquerque. <laughs> Population weird. <laughs> weird. Very weird. How are you feeling with being off the boat? Oh. Um. Uh, being on the boat, there's parts that I definitely miss. But we had a lot of good adventures, and I'm looking forward to all of our land adventures. It's been that much fun on the water exploring, and I'll have just as much, if not more, on land. How have you been on land? Uh, I feel like I've been living in a laptop.
living on a laptop, working on designs and what to do with our channel, or watching movies and shows, just on the bed, on the couch, on the laptop. That's where I felt like I've been. <laughs> two or three day, two or three good days at the beach and just on a laptop. I feel bored, pent up. I'd rather occupy that time doing stuff outside and learning with a tactile hands-on experience about more things. After a fun, beautiful drive, we made it to Texas. Now it's time to catch up with some family that we haven't seen in two years. Fingers crossed we also get some good news while here in Texas that our boat, Naughty Nature, finds her new family. But for now, we will keep enjoying the journey and wherever the road takes us. Thanks for coming along with us on this adventure. We'll keep you updated on what's next for us and Naughty Nature. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed the ride. See you in the next video, where we show you some of the fun in Texas. Cheers! Cheers! I'm so glad you're here. I'm so excited. Ta-ta! <laughs>